Um, for those that don't know uh, or haven't seen Oracle Guided Learning, we'll just quickly um, talk around what it can do for your Fusion application set. So it is um, an, a, a digital adoption platform. It is based and, and resides within the Fusion applications, and it is based on a contextual process. So it, it attaches itself to uh, um, the roles. We, we um, base the context around where the user is within the system and obviously the, the role that they have within the system, which obviously guides their access, etc. Um, it can be used for onboarding procedures. Um, it certainly is there to drive user efficiency and proficiency and competence within the system. And it's and it supports the um, the simplification of some of the processes within the system as well, which with um, obviously a solid set of learning material will you know smoothen out that learning curve as well so um, it's very much there to support your end user community in adopting the application set there's a lot of information on this slide but i guess the key thing here that i wanted to cover today was the idc statistic at the top which is you know 80 percent of the problems relating to application errors are from user related mistakes. So um, obviously with guided learning uh, in your system, guiding users at the point of need, um, we can alleviate a lot of those user uh, data errors uh, and usability issues as well. So that's one of the key things I wanted to pull out, but we'll be sending this, this pack out to everyone that's on this webinar. So you can run through the detail of this uh, in your own time. Um, but obviously we have a lot to cover today, so I'm gonna try and skip through these slides at a reasonable pace. Um, and again, talking about IDC reports, um, they have uh, reported back that there's a there's a 63 percent reduction in support requests to your help desk when when users uh, use Oracle guided learning. And it certainly uh, increases the migration and adoption of uh, applications in the cloud by up to 50 percent as well. So, you know, what we're talking about here is reducing human error, reducing uh, service requests on on questions that are based around how do I do something rather than there being a technical issue or a database issue um, with uh, with the system itself. We can um, obviously optimize training by layering the training approach using uh, Oracle guided learning as a support function live within the application. And certainly with the analytics that sit within guided learning, we're able to look at the behavior of the users um, and that can support ongoing maturity and innovation with the product as well. So, um, you know, there's a lot of business value here for organizations that adopt guided learning. And the IDC have found that normally there's a return on investment payback within three months of, of going live with Oracle guided learning. So that's quite substantial. So just to clear off the differences between Oracle Guided Learning uh, Premium and Oracle Guided Learning Included. Now, remember, Oracle Guided Learning Included is the free version that's part of Fusion applications. Anyone that is a Oracle Fusion user can request for um, Oracle Guided Learning Included to be activated. It will need to be configured past that stage. Um, but what you would get within that is the um, the console, which is where we would develop uh, items or um, guides, as we call them, and you're you're able to have 15 concurrent guides um, within the system at any one time. There is a use case library that can be uh, can be leveraged, as well as that. Um, there are business process business process training and analytics built into that, and um, uh, there's online training and support from Oracle as well. With the premium version, you get you do get a huge base guide uh, uh, of content, um, hundreds of items that can be leveraged um, to you know expedite that adoption. Uh, you're able to then transition into multi-language. You can build in surveys and polls, and you get a custom support manager from Oracle as well. Um, on top of that, with guided learning in pre uh, guided learning premium you can uh, extend out to third party applications. Now, a lot of um, a lot of people aren't aware that Oracle Guided Learning is 
used on third party applications. So if you've got an end to end process where you've got um, a third party product, you know, such as uh, ServiceNow, for example, for filling an end to end process, you can use guided learning on those third party applications. So that's worth bearing in mind and is quite a big step change when you look at the premium offering.